Arsenal Fan TV. It was disappointing today. What did you make of it? Uh, it wasn't a good performance. We've got to look at it. It's Europa League. He's using it as a second eleven, mm. and I appreciate it. But what I, what I want to make a point of today is every single game, OK, we, we scraped through and we've been comfortable. But last year, we didn't come top four because our top players didn't perform. Why aren't they sitting on the bench? Our top players, if it was a Champions League game, they'd be in the team starting, playing 90 minutes. It's exactly the same. Now it's Europa League. They should be sitting on the bench. That should be a punishment. They're getting the same wages. Oh, why aren't they sitting on the bench? If we need them, we bring them on. But, no, but don't you look on it and say to yourself, though, but on the other hand, it's a real chance to give some of these youngsters like Reese Nelson, Maitland Niles, that I always pronounce wrong, right? To give some of these guys game after game, high intensity games in big stadiums against teams with big support that really, really want to win, real cup finals for other teams. So it's, it's a good learning for them, isn't it? Without a doubt. I enjoy, I enjoy watching Europa League and them boys starting. I love seeing that that's 11. When it ain't going right though, I think them big boys should be on the bench to bring them on and bring them a bit of oomph. Mm. Like, I've got no problem with starting and no problem with losing, yeah. but I just think the big boys should be on the bench because as far as I'm so concerned... You, so what you're saying is like tonight, have like an Alexis or have like, say, someone like that, if yeah. If it ain't going I'm, right, you can bring them on. Yeah, I'm not putting the sole blame on them guys for coming out of the top four last season. Mm. But if we were playing Champions League football, these guys would be playing two games a week. They're getting the same money and yet they're, they're having a week's rest every mm. single time. If we're doing better, than, if we were first, second in the league, I wouldn't say, yeah, fair enough, we're doing better. But we're not. Mm. So, you know, they should be on the bench and that should be like, yeah, you come on when you, when you mm. need it. If we were, you know, winning the league or, you know, top of the league, I wouldn't have an argument. But mm. that should me, it should be a punishment for, we should have seven subs that are strong subs in my opinion. Check sits on the bench. Mm. You know, what's the difference? So Does, it, does this, um, finally, does this have any, any effect on the weekend? I mean... No. For me, no. Like, you, I see it was a very half-hearted performance. And then, for me, Jack Wilshere is, is my favourite player at Arsenal, to be honest. And what I'll say about Wilshere, he's, he didn't look interested today. And I don't know whether it's the case of, he's got four games prior to this in the uh, Europa League. He's got man match three out of four games. And then he didn't get a call off the top, and he didn't even come on one minute. And did he think, well, if I'm, if I'm playing well, I'm not getting picked. Why well, should I play well? Not saying that's the reason, but he probably thinks in his head, like, what's the point putting a shift in when I'm not getting picked for the Premier League when it matters? You know, he probably, he probably mentally as well. But it, it has no effect on Sunday. Like, Burnley is a complete different... It'll be 11 changes, and it has no effect on it. But, you know, we're going to lose in Europa League with, with that kind of team, although it's great experience for that team as well. So, but I do think if... You know, Jack Wilshere could be best player, probably score a hat-trick and not get a look in. I think that's how the way it goes at the minute. So.